Hey, what's happening, man? Thank y'all for checking in with me one more time, man. Life behind the beard. Uh, I'm gonna touch on a few things today, man. Uh, of course, uh, thank y'all for checking out the website. Follow me on Instagram. The website is lifebehindthebeard.co. For all your beard all, all your beard balm, your beard of apparel, your hats, different things like that. You know, something real nice for the fellas that really believe in this beard life. Um, some of the guys, I just put the clippers on my head just now, man, to knock the fuzz off. I'm gonna shave my head in a minute. Some of the guys asked me about this this honey thing. I ain't got the beard combed out yet. I've been working this morning and stuff, man. But some of y'all asked me, do I really put honey on my beard for condition? I've tried a lot of other conditioners. Matter of fact, I still got stuff I've tried over here, but I don't I don't deal with it anymore. Um, I just found that, you know what I'm saying, natural honey, it just worked better for me as far as softening and cleansing my beard. Um, you know, it is what it is, you know what I mean? I still got the morning beard going on right now. So I'm gonna show y'all how I do this thing, man. Uh, I made this video a while back about uh, about using honey, man. So I'm gonna, oh man, you need to get a different type of honey, man. You need a better honey. All right, man, whatever. I got another honey. I've been using this for a while. So, I say, I take it, man. I put it in my hand. You know what I'm saying? Y'all see it ain't, it's just honey, man. Ain't, ain't nothing special about it. I take a little bit of water, drop it down, and um, I just rub it with my beard, man. You know what I'm saying? I just rub it in. You know, depending on how long your beard is, how thick your beard is, you know, the fullness and things like that is, uh, you know, going to determine how much you need. You don't really need a whole lot, um, but you're going to need, you know, enough to, to cover the hairs and stuff like that, man. And you get in there, you know, do what you got to do. Now, you want to have a towel near or a shirt or something, man, because um, it's going to run a little bit, you know what I'm saying? It's going to run a little bit. And that's, that's, you know what I'm saying, it is what it is. It's maintenance, you know what I'm saying? It's man maintenance. <laughs> man maintenance. Sound like a shirt, don't it? <laughs> hey, man, but uh, while I'm doing this, man, I just want to say thank you guys again, man, for, you know, just rocking with me, man. You know what I'm saying? I, I'm just a good, humble brother, man. I'm such a blessed guy, man, and trying to do this stuff, you know, with the YouTube and stuff. But, you know, a lot of times with the YouTube, I'm not a, I ain't trying a whole lot of products because, Life Behind the Beer has our own products now. And it ain't it ain't many more ways to tell a man how to apply beard all, how to apply this, how to apply the eyes. Fuck that. You know what I'm saying? This is how I get down. You know what I mean? Uh, I did it. I found my way. You can look at my older videos where I was finding my way, you know, trying other methods that, you know, some of the other great YouTubers were doing. Hey, and I finally found what works for me and I'm going with it, I'm sticking with it, you know what I mean? I took my time, did some research on oils and products and mixtures and chemistry of, you know, just developing stuff, man. And I came up with an awesome product. It's doing really, really good. Um, the numbers are growing, growing and growing and growing. Uh, I'm not like a, I'm not crazy with the marketing. Like I don't, I'm a creator. I'm not really, marketing is my strong suit, you know what I'm saying? So, you know, we're working on stuff like that. Um, you know, but hey, it is what it is. So, once I do that with the honey, man, I go ahead and do it like this here. And it's just like a little detangler brush. I think I took this from my daughter. I'm sure we all have been there with your girlfriend and your wife and your combs and all this stuff like that. Uh, and I just spread it through there, man, just kind of straighten it out throughout all the hairs. And you can see, you know, how the beard start changing up, you know. And uh, normally around this time, I'm not gonna put y'all through the shaving my head thing, uh, but normally I go ahead and condition and then I shave my head and that give me time for the conditioner to sit. Then I get in the shower, rinse it out, you know what I'm saying? Then I come back after I pat it dry, you know what I'm saying? Um, I either come back with our grown man. You know, this is, <laughs> it's funny about this one, man. This, this is the second fragrance, uh, second oil I, I created and um, this one did better than the first one, but in my my opinion, I like the first one better. You know what I'm saying? The seasoned gentleman. Um, this here is the seasoned gentleman. Uh, you got grown man, you got seasoned gentleman, of course. Some of the guys asked for a bomb, but it took a little minute because you know what I'm saying. You got you got to know what you're putting out there, man. You just can't be 
pulling shit in the bottle and just giving it to people. You know, so you can't do stuff like that, man. Um, so of course we developed a nice bomb for you guys, man. Um, you know, for you guys that really don't know much about bomb, bomb just for the whole. You know what I'm saying? It's just gonna hold things together. Um, and especially like I'm black, you know what I'm saying? I'm 100% black. Um, so a lot of times my hair, it'll tend to, you know, frizz up or, you know what I'm saying? It won't, it won't lay like I want it. You know, and if you follow me on Instagram, y'all know I love to get clean and go out and put my brims on and I own that entertainment company and stuff. So, you know, you, you want to put a good bomb on, man, just to hold you down, make sure you look, you know what I'm saying, presentable when you slide. You know what I'm saying? Um, you know, if you're trying to do your thing, you know what I mean? You want to look presentable when, you, when you're stepping out. So a good bomb for that. Um, our beard all, like I said, you can get it at lifebehindthebeard.co. Um, the fragrance is amazing. You know what I mean? If you look at some of the reviews uh, up and down, either my personal Instagram, which is Life Behind the Beard, or the company Instagram page, which is Life Behind the Beard 101, uh, which is the one me and my brother run, um, you, you can see the reviews, you know what I'm saying? Like I say, I'm not, I'm not big of a hype man. I'm not big on being a hype man. Oh, this is the best, 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 this, this. Yes, it's a fucking outstanding product. You know what I'm saying? Like, it is, hands down. You know what I mean? And I haven't got anybody, oh, this shit did this to my beard. Oh, it messed up my beard. Oh, it did this. I haven't received that. You know what I'm saying? And if I ever do receive it, I'm going to ask him what it was or, you know what I'm saying? What, what, you know what I'm saying? Talk to me because everybody don't like the color red. You know what I'm saying? So it is what it is. You know what I mean? But I just, I'm just grateful for that, man. I hadn't received any negative energy, any negative comments or nothing about the product. So if you guys, you know, you try this, try to get light behind the beard a shot. You know what I'm saying? That's all. Give us a shot. You know, y'all been following me since the first video two, two years, I think, ago. Damn near two, maybe even three. I don't know. You know what I mean? Check us out. Um, so what I do after this honey get in here and see it's going to kind of get dry and sticky. After that, I jump in the shower, rinse it out. And I come back, you know what I'm saying, pat it dry like I was saying earlier. Apply my oil, you know what I'm saying, rub it in real good. You know, oil really ain't for the hair, it's really for the skin. You know what I'm saying? And um, hit it with my balm to get my whole kind of style and shape a little bit. I'm in the wind, you know what I'm saying? I'm in the wind. Um, and that's really about it, man. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, you want to get this honey thing a try, give it a try. You want to give our products a try, lifebehindthebeard.co. Uh, follow us on Instagram, man. Thank you for everybody that subscribed, liked, commented. Um, I am just want to say thank you again, man. You know what I'm saying? I ain't really got a whole lot. Try not to hold y'all guys long because I be wanting to talk with y'all so much, man, about life and, and goals and visions in certain situations that I just sometimes I be talking too long, sometimes not so much. You know what I'm saying? But this is going to be one of the short days. I was working out yesterday. I tweaked my lower back, so I'm kind of like on hold right now, man. You know what I'm saying? It's always when you're trying to work on something, boy. You know what I mean? But I think of what it was, my my shoulders is in and my upper back is getting stronger than my lower back. So I'm putting a lot of weight up here and they compress some things back there, man. So it is what it is. I'm still going to the gym. Though. I do legs or calves or something. You know what I'm saying? But y'all be blessed, man. Thank y'all again for all y'all support. Like behind the beard.co. Like, comment, subscribe, man. One love.